Hello world and hello Philippines, hello mermaids and unicorns, boys and girls, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be playing with this makeup palette right here, so stay tuned. If you're new here, my name is Georgel B. I am a mother of three boys, 11, 9, and 19 months old, and I am obsessed with makeup and everything beauty related. I am a makeup hoarder as well. And I said that I am going to be in a no buy, no, low buy for this year, 2021, and that I was only going to purchase makeup that um, interests me, that tickles my fancy, you know? And so. If you can relate to me and my makeup obsession, and if you're interested to see how this palette serves its purpose, then keep on watching. But before we head on to the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it. My thumb is crooked. <laughs> All right, let's get on to the video. So the reason why I did not um, put on eyebrows today right away, I usually start my video with eyebrows, is because this bad boy right here is called the Transition Palette by Dominic Cosmetics. I actually am a big fan of hers as well. I follow her here on YouTube. Um, she came out with uh, three different palettes now, or more than that. No, I think five or six. I don't know. I, I can't keep up. But this palette comes with a mirror. He marketed this as a full face palette like you could literally create a full face look using just this palette because you know she has shades down here where you can use it for your eyebrows and then right here are bronzers and I guess blushes and then setting powders or whatever and then you have your transition so I actually played with this palette already and I was able to create really, really cute looks. Mostly, I love my monochromatic looks and I used that for this one. The eyebrows actually did pretty well as well. So I wanted to share that experience with you guys. So if you guys have been wanting to, you know, get your hands on this and you just haven't seen enough reviews about it or people are not talking more about it or people are not using it actually, then um, maybe this might be the video for you. Yeah. All right, let's start. Okay, I'm going to start with my eyebrows. I normally do not show how I do my eyebrows, but you will today. But Are my eyebrows even? <laughs> I'm actually having a good eyebrow day today. You know you have those days, right? I know everyone can relate. Not every day is a good eyebrow day. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. The eyebrows are done. <laughs> um, the shades that I used um, on that one, by the way, is Ash right here. And then this one, uh, I used uh, the tip on my eyebrows just to darken it a little bit. And it looks pretty, pretty good, right? It's so natural. And that's actually bought um, her new and latest uh, skin line also I bought a primer and then this one is the mist so we're gonna try that out today too well actually I've been using this one and guys let me tell you if you have dry skin this will really really hydrate your skin for reals for reals okay so if you guys are planning to pick up her product any of her product you guys should give this a try. I can't speak for the oily skin out there. I have normal to dry skin and this really plumps and hydrates my skin. This is really good, you guys. You have to give this a try. So this one, I'm going to tell you, uh, this is a blur and moisture serum primer. So it is, it has that serum consistency. I cannot talk today. And it's, it's really good for your skin. So give it a try. Okay, so we are primed and ready to shine. Okay, so I'm just gonna do our base. And as always, I'm gonna do some of this Becca Under Eye Cream Brightener. Same concealer as always. I am back on this again. 
my NARS Soft Matte Complete Concealer. I, I, I could never memorize all the products I have, but yeah. I love this concealer. I'm going to put on my foundation. For today's foundation, I'm going to use the Pretty Fresh um, Hyaluronic Hydrating Foundation by ColourPop. And I'm going to mix that with this JLo Beauty That Star Filter Complexion Booster. Yeah. <laughs> in the shade rose gold by the way so i'm actually going to be doing a review on this one so watch out for that one as well if you guys have your eyes set on jlo beauty it's right, two pumps and i'm gonna do maybe one pump or if that's considered one pump i don't know Right, so our base is done now let's bronze slash contour maybe I don't know back to this I'm going to mix the shade caramel and toffee 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 hmm. how do you say that right? toffee Google how do you say toffee <laughs> toffee toffee why is Google British British why are you British? Toffee. Toffee. Weird. Okay, back to regular programming. <laughs> I am going to mix caramel and toffee. <laughs> now I can never say that word right now. It's these two shades right here. This is caramel. My God, dinosaur fingers. This is caramel and this is toffee. I told you, I never pronounced that right. I'm gonna mix those two shades. Very pigmented and it applied so smoothly on my face and you could actually blend it, like it blends like a dream. I wanna feel them. Yeah, feels like butter. So when I've, I've been using this palette um, for about two weeks now and I've actually just I've actually just been using toffee on my face This is the first time I've mixed caramel and toffee Together, I don't know why I keep saying that word weird now And I actually like the combination like you could just get away with just this and not even putting on blush, right? Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay More Okay, we're gonna. I'm gonna use this shade soft and sweet, and then blushing. I'm gonna mix them together. Ladies and gentlemen, I have been talking for I don't know how long, and my camera was not recording. I'm mm -hmm. together, and that's the blush you guys see. Chudu chudu. And then I also set my um, concealer with the powder or the cream color right here. And this is in the shade Natural. So I use that one as well to... Um, I can't talk. Set the concealer. Oh my gosh. I used that to set the concealer. And then I actually used it all over my face as well. So face is done. Now we're going to move on to Z eyes. I think I'm gonna do the same thing with what I did with my brush. I'm gonna mix soft and sweet and blushing together for my transition. So we're just gonna use that as our transition shade. Gosh. Okay, I'm gonna grab a more precise brush like this and I'm gonna dip into blushing only. And I'm just gonna concentrate that right here on our crease. But keeping it on the outer corner only that brush same brush I'm actually gonna dip back into blushing it has a fine tip so I'm just gonna go around here all right I'm gonna grab a smaller brush like this and I'm gonna dip into the shade chai right here this one right here and I'm gonna use that to intensify the look the outer corner 
just right here though and then bring it a little bit on the crease Perhaps using the same brush we're gonna dip back into chai and we're gonna intensify the lower lash line as well Okay, I think I'm gonna stop there. I love the look on those eyes. I don't know if I want to stay matte or want to put like a little bit of shimmery onto our face today. So we shall see what happens. Oh, my leg is dead. So that's pretty much it with the whole face. Like, so we created a whole look, right? I'm just gonna go ahead and curl my lashes and put on some mascara and I'll be right back. I'm back. <laughs> All right, so lashes are done. I've actually tight lined my eyes as well on my upper lash line and then I set my eyebrows. And so now we are gonna go for, I think I wanna go for highlight first. And for today's uh, video, I'm gonna be using the uh, Jaclyn Hill highlights in the shade Mesmerized. Let's go for lipstick. Uh, let me go ahead and line my lips first. For today's video, I'm gonna be using the NYX suede matte lip liner Bruno keep it keep it down my love in the shade soft spoken actually one of my favorite liner I have two here that I want to see which one looks better this one's I don't know a little bit this is so peachy right here this is by Patrick Ta and in the shade she's secure oh yes honey she is <laughs> And then this is uh, Bare Minerals in a shade Swag. Yes, I got the swag. <laughs> I'm gonna go for, uh, okay, I'm gonna do something here. I'm gonna mix the two. I'm gonna apply the Patrick Ta first. Okay. Oof, I love this combination right here. I think I'm gonna stick to this combination. Forget about the bare minerals for now. We'll use that some other time because this right here, the lip liner and this combo, just ties everything down for me. You know what? What's missing though is our inner corner highlights. Yes, honey, we need some. I'm gonna use the same highlighter, and we're gonna put some here. Gonna go ahead and set our face. I'm gonna be using the Dominic Cosmetics. Um, Ultra Hydrating Fine Mist as well. I can't stop, I want more. Mark, it is for real fine mist. Okay. Hey okay, guys. Okay, so recap. This bad boy right here, I'm gonna put the price somewhere in the screen. It is worth it for whatever price it is. The formulation on this one is bomb. It's It blends seamlessly. It's really soft on your face and smooth. My gosh, like, I mean, the look that we created today, I created, you watched. It's crazy. I love it. It's 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 a natural spring glam. You know, those kind of moments when you just need to be glammed, although you're just going to go to the kitchen and make yourself coffee or something. Yeah. We all do that. <laughs> all right. So, um, and then also, <laughs> there's two things right here that I bought with it. Um, this is the Ultra Fine Mist. My gosh, you guys. If you're in a market for getting setting mist or this is it i mean if you're gonna go to her website and you're gonna buy the palette might as well buy this two right here this is also the primer you guys should give it a try it's a really good combo and then this one you're all set mother's day birthday gift advance whatever you deserve you know to you deserve to treat yourself, all right? So if you're gonna do that and go to her website, I suggest you buy all three. It's really good. And you, anyways, you guys, that is all it. Thank you so much for watching. If you made it this far, thank you. Thank you. I'm actually at 200 subscribers. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh, I could cry. Okay. <laughs> thank you so much for supporting this little channel of mine here in YouTube. I really appreciate it. It really means a lot to me that I see views, although it's not a whole lot, but even just seven people that views my video at any given day or any given time, it makes me really, really happy. 
and makes me just inspires me to just continue filming i mean this is what i love to do i love makeup and i want to share my experience with makeup i mean who knows someone out there can you know relate to me and has the same personality as me so right so again that's it you guys thank you so much for watching and i hope you guys enjoyed this um very make short makeup review or long makeup review but i did try it all on my face i wanted to show it to you guys so okay that's it thank you guys so much for watching please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel before leaving it's for free anyways yeah i'll see you guys in my next video bye Give my boy.